let's see whether this month's bright spark will elicit the same positive response. This time, our inventor hails from Singapore, where he's attempted to combine an old school computer game with outdoor activity. Hi, I'm Adrian Chiok from Mixed Reality Lab in Singapore, and I invented the human Pac-Man. Human Pac-Man is, is basically a wearable computer with a head-mounted display and various sensors which we have, which is sensing my uh, body's position and as well as the head orientation. So we know exactly where I am and what I'm looking at. So when we do this, we can then augment the real world which I'm in now with the virtual world. So this Pac-Man world, I'm seeing it as part of the real world. I can see cookies in front of me and I'm walking through them as if I'm the human Pac-Man. The game is designed so it actually promotes that you must uh, play in a, with your friends in a very social way and a physical way. So you have to move your body around. So we're combining kind of sports, um, social interaction and computer entertainment. So what we're aiming for is that we're going to taking the human Pac-Man and bringing it into more mobile devices. Within two years, we'll be able to see full commercial uh, human Pac-Man type games on the mobile phones. So is the time right for a human Pac-Man? Look good to us, but what does our expert think? I think it's, it's marketable in a niche. Uh, I don't think at this stage it's mass marketable. Uh, we would obviously like to see a variety of games, a variety of experiences to make use of that particular piece of hardware. That would be the most realistic mechanism to move it forward, would be to, to take the technology and to actually translate it into lots of different experiences, whether it's an education, or whether it's a sports experience, or whether it's a, a pure entertainment experience. So we would like to see FIFA in there, we would like to see Harry Potter coming into this kind of experience so we can really cross across the, the digital divide. That's the view from our expert, but we'd also like to hear your thoughts on the prospects for the human Pac-Man. We'd also like to hear about any big ideas you might have, so send us your feedback and ideas to us at spark at cnn.com. That's spark at cnn.com. Now, early in the program, we've heard how Honda and Toyota have been investing in hybrid cars. In the